Hey guys, it's Lala. Welcome back to my channel. So as you can see with the thumbnail, this is a Dollar Tree haul and it's a pretty big one. Um, first, I want to say if you're new, welcome. I hope that you stay subscribe, hang out with us here on the channel. And if you're returning, welcome back. So I can be a little bit chatty. So there's a lot of stuff. So I'm going to try not to make this very long, but if this is too long for you, go up in the top corner of your screen, push the little three, the three dots and watch me like three times speed, like, you know, and then you can watch me faster. So, okay, let me go ahead and get into the haul. I'm just going to grab a bag and show you what's in it. So the first thing I have is this here. It's, and I apologize for the glare. I have my ring light on. It's like super bright. Um, this is the Palm Olive Spray Away. That's what it looks like there. So I'm wondering if this is kind of like going to be comparable to like the Dawn Power Wash, which is what I normally use. But it says Ultra Palm Olive Spray Away. Um, quickly dissolves stuck on grease and it is 16.9 fluid ounces. Okay, this is new. I mean, to me, I don't, I've never seen it. Um, this is one of their adhesive coverings that they have, but they finally have it in marble. Beautiful white and gray marbling. I love it. Um, they had the non-adhesive one in gray, like the shelf liners. They've had the marble in those already, but I was really excited to see the adhesive. It is 18 inches by one and a half yards. Um, contact paper. That's the word I was looking for. So I'm really excited for it. I have a couple things in mind that I want to do with it. So I may end up needing to purchase more, but um, yeah. Okay. So I love stationery. I love it. I use notebooks all of the time. Before I continue, there's Axel. He um, recently had, um, he was recently neutered. Um, so he was not neutered before, but he was recently neutered. And this is his like surgical suit that I got him off of Amazon. It looks stretched out because of how he's laying, but um, I got him this so he could wear this instead of wearing a cone. He has a cone. He wore it for a day until his um, surgical suit got here, but this is so much more comfortable for him. You know, that those cones can be so uncomfortable. So this is him. And Billy is here too, just to... Billy's here too. So they're both in here. Okay. So back to what I was saying. I love stationery. I, I'm a list maker. I love to write lists. Um, it helps me get things done. Um, I feel like I'm more productive. And also with my full-time job, I, um, have a lot of meetings. There's always things changing. Um, and I need to like write notes down. So anyways, I got some notebooks. The first one is this, it's so freaking cute. It says stay classy and they have multiple designs of this notebook as well as list pads and a bunch of like different puppies. Like they have French bulldogs, they had pugs, they have all sorts of dogs, but this is the one that was my favorite. Stay classy with this little like cocker spaniel, like giving me like pinup girl with the with the bow and the glasses. Um, and the back is just plain polka dot. This is part of the Crown Jewels collection. They always have some really cute things. And then inside of it, it is lined paper that's kind of like polka dotted in the background. So um, I did take pictures of other designs and I posted them on Instagram. So if you're not following me there, it's in the description box below. But I post a lot of things over there that I do not buy. Um, so you can always see other items if I didn't purchase them. The other notebook I got, I thought it was just beautiful. It's also by Crown Jewels and it's this beautiful kind of um, like a cream colored cover with this gold foil, foil lettering that says notes. That's what the back looks like. Again, Crown Jewels. I just think it's so beautiful. And inside of it, it says notes at the top of all the pages and they're lined. Okay, next item is this super cute tote bag. How perfect is this? Um, the brand is Mother Earth Thanks You. That's what it says. Um, it is a Greenbrier product. It is 100% recyclable. Recyclable? Recyclable. Recyclable. That's how you say it. I say recyclable? Recyclable. Okay, anyways. 
I thought it's so cute. How perfect is this for like summer? If you're going to the beach, if you're gonna sit out by the pool, or even if you're just gonna use it to go shopping and you don't wanna use the bags, it's just plain on that. But it's so freaking adorable. I cannot wait to use it, it's so cute. Okay guys, I was really excited to see these. I cannot wait to give them a try. They are by Refresh Me Drink Mixers, and there are three different flavors. And this one is the Margarita. Now, these are non-alcoholic. These are just the mixers, okay? So you'll have to add your own alcohol. They have zero calories. They are sugar-free. Um, and this is a 12-ounce bottle. So the bottle says, Refresh Me was created so you could quench your guilty pleasure without the guilt. Add to any of your favorite spirits and also use to add a zing of great taste to water, sparkling water, or any other beverage that you enjoy. All of our items have no sugar and zero calories. So I think that's awesome. Here's the... If you want to read those but okay so this is the margarita i also got the mojito and then they also had the strawberry margarita so i thought for a dollar 25 to be able to try all three of these flavors i am going to try these out so if you would like to see me review these please comment down below let me know that you want to see a review of these and um, I will make a drink with all of these and I'll review them. Um, I'll probably review them with alcohol and also in like sparkling waters and things like that. Um, the different ways that you can use them, but I'm so excited that I found these. Also, I saw this here. It's by, it's non-dairy banana milk. It's called Banana Wave and that's what it looks like here. And this is the strawberry. They also had a regular unsweetened banana milk. I didn't get that one. But I did want to try the strawberry. You can see it is plant-based. Um, on the back of it, it says it's plant-based, gluten-free, kosher, uh, no high fructose corn syrup, no artificial flavors, colors, or sweeteners. A percentage of our proceeds goes to fight child hunger. Um, that's awesome. I really, really cannot wait to try this. It's 32 fluid ounces. Um, and the expiration is... October 13th of 2022. So plenty of shelf life. I'm going to stick this in my fridge and actually I'm going to be trying this in the morning. I am really excited to try it. This was an amazing deal. Um, this is a six pack, a whole six pack of the Evian sparkling cans of water. You get six 330 milliliters they had different flavors. I picked up the raspberry and ginseng. They also had a mint. Um, I don't remember the other flavors that they had right now. Um, if I remember, I'll put them on the screen. But I got the raspberry and ginseng. It's mineral enhanced drink. Feed your mind is what it says. Oh, and it has magnesium and zinc in it as well. So I thought a six pack for $1.25. This is an amazing deal. Um, I did go into one of my stores and I saw that they had opened these up and they were selling individual cans for $1.25. I don't believe that that is what's supposed to happen. Um, I saw the six packs. I've seen other people haul them. And then in three of my stores, they were all selling them the entire six pack for $1.25. So um, just keep that in mind if you check, if you see them, but amazing deal. So next, um, I picked up this, um, I think it's Ellie's. That's how I've always said it. It's the four flat pitas. It is just original pita bread. One pita is 220 calories, um, 0.5 grams of fat, 46 grams of carbs. And so, I mean, it's not like maybe the healthiest, I guess, but um, you can do all sorts of things with pita bread. You can, you cut them in half and like make yourself like a pita sack or something like that, you know, like a breakfast sack or a sandwich. You can use them to make pizzas. You can do chips. You can, um, people even put them on the grill. Like you, pita bread is like, you know, you can do all sorts of stuff with it. So I got these, there's four of them. Oh, it says it right on the front of the packaging. It says grill it, roll it, fold it, dip it, top it. Okay. Um, these have a sell-by date of June 19th of 2022, so there's still plenty of time, but they won't last that long. Um, so, yeah, I've eaten other things by this brand that Dollar Tree has, and I really enjoy them, so I'm excited to try them. If you've tried these, comment down below and let me know. I would like to say when I went to Dollar Tree, it was actually today, this afternoon, and I had not eaten a bite of food, 
So that's never a great thing. Um, I do want to make some egg salad and I was out of relish. So I saw the Vlasic sweet relish there. So I thought, hmm, I'll go ahead and pick it up. It's 10 fluid ounces. I believe that this is more than $1.25 at the grocery store. Um, either way, it was convenient because I was there. So I grabbed that. Hey, I cannot wait to try these. Um, actually, I might try one of these at the end of the video. So stay tuned if you want to see it. But it's the new Warheads Ooze, Ooze Chews Ropes. So it has watermelon, blue raspberry, and green apple. Sour, chewy candy filled with ooze. So one of my favorite candies are the Sweet Tart Chewy Ropes. And so these, this is what that reminded me of. And I really like sour candy. So I'm going to try these at the end of the video. Okay. I don't know if you've ever had back in the day the Cream Saver candies. These are the Coastal Bay Confections Creamy Delight Hard Candy. And these are supposed to be comparable to Cream Savers. And they come in the flavors blackberry, peach, and strawberry. So, um, hello. I cannot, I used to love cream savers, so I'm gonna give these a try. And then Greg wanted to try these. Um, these are the Sour Patch Kids in the grape. And it says new, not so sour. But these are the grape Sour Patch Kids, and these are for Greg. His favorite are the watermelon. Um, and I sent him a picture of these and I said, do you want to try them? And he said, yes, with many exclamation marks. So grab those for him. Again, I told you this was random. I'm just grabbing bags. I picked up these um, two. They're by the Crafter Square Permanent Black Vinyl. I got two of them. Um, each of them is 12 inches by 48 inches. And I'll tell you something. I have used this vinyl already. It is thin, but it does cut fine on my Cricut. Um, it cuts fine on my Cricut Explore Air 2 as well as my Cricut Joy. I have used it on both. It adheres just fine. I've had no problems with it. Um, so that is just my opinion, but I think that it's a it's a pretty good deal for the vinyl that you get at Dollar Tree. I love little um, water enhancers. I make my water taste good. It helps me drink as much water as I should be. And these are sugar-free and they're by the Jelly Belly brand. And this, you get six of the on-the-go packets, and this is the Berry Blue. And then I also picked up the Very Cherry. So I'm really excited to try both of these, and I'll let you guys know in a future video how they are. And then I needed some measuring cups. I have measuring cups for my kitchen, but I needed some for crafting. Um, a lot of the crafting I do um, now, for, especially for my Etsy shop, I'm mixing together resin and epoxy and things like that. So I needed some measuring cups or spoons um, and this had both so it has your measuring spoons as well as your cups and so I just went ahead and picked up some of these. I have an order that I have to package up and um, a couple orders and I did not have any bubble wrap and I have to place an order on Amazon so I just grabbed some of the bubble wrap from Dollar Tree they call it cushion wrap it's the Jot brand and you get 12 inches by six feet it's not the best deal okay so if you need like a lot of bubble wrap, buy it on Amazon, go to Office Depot, Walmart, something like that. It's not the greatest deal, but it will work in a pinch. I thought this was pretty interesting. This is the um, Kelowna brand, I'm assuming. Gourmet beer can chicken seasoning and rub. That's what it looks like there. Um, it is 2.5 ounces. What does it say that's in it? Ingredients, salt, orange peel, onion, garlic, coriander, sugar, oregano, crushed red pepper, black pepper, thyme, citric acid, and extractive of paprika. It's packed by Colina Brothers in North Bergen, New Jersey. So, I can't tell if that noise outside is thunder or fireworks. Anyways, so, I'm excited to try this um, on some chicken, beer can chicken. It just sounded interesting. I know that that's a recipe because I've seen someone make beer can chicken before. Um, so I just thought the seasoning sounded interesting and it looks pretty seasoned, you know? They also had another burger one. I didn't get that, but um, I believe I took pictures and it's on Instagram. This was laying on my floor and I couldn't remember if I showed you guys this or not in a previous haul. Um, but this is the Essentials brand mop and broom holder. It just looks like this here and it goes on your wall as you can see and you can hang your items from it. 
Um, I feel like I showed you guys this before uh, and it must have fallen out of a bag, but either way, I got it. I picked up another one of these. Um, I am loving the Dollar Tree storage containers I have for many, many years, actually. This is one of the tool, ben the tool bench hardware ones, so it's over like in the tool section. They're calling it a hardware storage case. That's what they're calling it there, but I like it because of all the little compartments that are in here for things like rhinestones specifically. I use a lot of rhinestones and pearls and things like that for the blinging that I do, um, and I can never have enough storage. Okay, I have just two bags left. I told you guys I was hungry today. I thought these were interesting, and I didn't remember seeing these at my Dollar Tree before. The brand is Kitchen Fixins, and they are crispy jalapenos, and it's a three ounce bag. Um, you could add these to anything, salads, burgers, tacos, hot dogs. I mean, you name it. It's kind of like, you know, like the crispy onions that you get, you put on top of green bean casserole or your salads. Same thing, but jalapenos. So I thought this was a pretty cool thing and I can't wait to try it. Okay, I did get another candy um, because they were just like the other ones, but smaller. These were the Warheads. They're the Ooze Chews. So they're, they're like the ropes, but smaller, okay? but smaller, but I'm gonna try these at the end. But it's kind of the same thing. I feel like I hauled these twice. Um, I got some of these, what are they calling them? Little paper cups. This is for pouring my resin, that's why I got them. I believe I got another pack of them as well. Did I show them already? I don't know, but I got these at one store and then forgot and got another one. So here's the first ones. They had these, now I don't know if these are the best deal for $1.25, I don't remember how much they cost in the grocery store, but they are by McCormick and they're grill mates. This is the brown sugar bourbon marinade mix and it's made with McCormick spices. So I grabbed this one and I'm probably actually gonna be using this on some ribs coming up soon. And then I also grabbed the grill mates mesquite marinade mix and it's the Stubbs legendary flavors. And that's the one I got there. I just don't have one of these, so I needed one. It's a basting brush like the little silicone. Um, I don't have one. And every time I make something where I wish that I had one, I'm like, oh, I have to remember to get one at Dollar Tree. And then I always forget. And then when I do remember, I can't find them. So today was a win. Hey guys, this was so cute. It's a headband. You guys know I love a headband, especially with a knot, but I like how like kind of flat it is and not super poofy. I just think it's beautiful leopard print. So I had to pick it up because it's gorgeous. How cute is this? I've never seen these before. It's the Crafter Square Rainbow Macrame Kit. I, I have no idea how to macrame. I have never done it. I just think it's so freaking adorable. It says it includes one cotton rope, three colored cotton cord. That's it. So I'm assuming that's all you need. I'm, and instructions are in here as well. So I'm going to try it out. If you, I'm going to try to do this. I, I'll probably do it like in a vlog. So make sure you watch my vlogs if you wanna see me try it, but I think it's so cute. Okay, they have these in multiple colors. I did post pictures on my Instagram. These are little piggy banks and they are lips. You see the piggy bank here. They are lips. I just think they're so adorable. They go perfect with like, you know, my Lisa Frank unicorn, you know, I love them. And I'm actually gonna be blinging these. I'm gonna cover them all in rhinestones. Um, so I'll share that once that's done, but I have plenty of projects I have to do, but I wanted to get these because I didn't want to, you know, not get them because you know at Dollar Tree, if you don't get them now, they'll be gone later. This is a book. It originally sold for $12.99. I actually peeled off the Dollar Tree tag to see the tag on this, but it's called Inner Ramblings. That's what it looks like. And it says Inner Ramblings, a journal. And I was like, okay, what is this? So when you open it up, it tells you like this journal belongs to, and I'm just going to flip to a random page and it just, it's kind of reminds me of like, um, a wreck it journal, but like, or like a, um, or like a prompted journal. It's like a prompted journal. That's what it is. Um, but the way it was set up kind of reminded me of like a wreck it journal, a wreck this journal or however you say it. So it just has like different prompts, different things to do in here. Um, I'm always getting into trouble with my friend blank because, um, it has one that says, 
I cannot go a day without eating blank. Seriously, I crave it. This is a perfectly straight line I drew without a ruler. So it's just like, it's really cool. Um, I'm not going to be using this for myself. I actually got this um, for my niece, Bella. So I'm sure Bella is watching this and I can never surprise you because you always watch my videos. But um, I got this for her. She's at that age where I feel like she would like this. Um, so I got that for her. And I just think for $1.25, like this is awesome. And so make sure if you don't check out your book section, really like look at what's in there. I did post pictures on Instagram of a lot of other books and journals and things like that, um, that were in the book section at my stores. And there are a lot of really awesome things in there. Okay. 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 I'm in my last bag. I could not pass this up. Now I did buy two by accident, but these are also by the crown jewels brand. And I'm going to show you this one first. And it says it's a fitness journal and it's got oranges all over it. They look like oranges. I guess maybe they could be peaches. That looks like a butt crack. So I think that's a peach. Um, so there's peaches and it says fitness journal. So when you open it up, the first page says monthly goals. I'm going to get closer. So when you open it up, the first page says monthly goals and then at the top it has like you write the month in, it has all the days of the week and you can fill your goals out, right? Then when you turn the page here, you have measurement goals. Here you have your um, weight tracker. You can write it, you can draw a graft. Then when you turn the page, you have your meal tracker. And then over here, you have your fitness tracker. You also have a grocery list. And then it starts over. You can do the next month. And then each month you write in and it's the same thing over and over. So I thought this was super cool. Um, when it, like I told you earlier, I like to make lists and writing things down. I really enjoy doing. That's why I have a planner that I use. But I've, I don't like to keep my fitness or weight loss stuff in my planner. I like to keep those separately. It's just a preference for me. So I thought this would be perfect. Then I grabbed this one as well. It's got the daisies and the rainbows on it. Uh, what threw me off was this does not say anything on it. And I thought it was a different one. But it's actually the same exact thing. It just doesn't say fitness goals journal on the front of it. So I got another one. Um, so this will be in a future giveaway. So if you're interested, just stay tuned. I do have a giveaway coming up at the end of this month. Okay, so this is a card game. It's called Say What? And it's ages 12 and up, three plus players. Unscrabble, can't talk. It says Unscramble the Babble. There's 36 cards included. They had multiple versions of these little card games. Um, and what it is, is it basically, it says these frantic phonetics will make you babble along as you try to sound out the sentences without melting your brain. So it basically, if you look at the top little example, I don't know if you guys can see that, it says olive toe witch sunsets. Olive, I'm going to read it just like you, like you read it and it's not the word, but it sounds like something else. So olive toe witch sunsets, olive toe witch sunsets. I love to watch sunsets. So I thought it would be really fun to play with the girls or to turn into like a drinking game with Greg, maybe for a video. I don't know. It just sounded fun. Okay. I needed a Sharpie. This is a ultra fine tip, black permanent Sharpie. I needed it. Look, I told you more cups. So I did. I got two of them. Okay. These I bought for Greg. Now, I don't know how much they were full price, but I know they were more than $1.25. These are the signature collection gold toe socks. These are the native nomad. They are so nice. You get two pair and they are for shoe sizes six to 12 and a half. They feel incredibly, incredibly nice. It says they have arch support knit with lyocelli fibers and cushioned comfort. These are so soft and they look so nice. So I got this like like lighter blue with this tan and then there's like this darker blue with the tan and then I also grabbed these they're like the same colors but they don't have like those extra fibers in them 
So that's, I got that. So I got these for Greg and I just think that they are really nice socks for $1.25. I could not beat it. I have a craft. I want to do something with these craft related. I thought these were a really cool thing to find. So they are some kind of just like acrylic, I guess, or ceramic. I mean, they're ceramic, but this is just a plain ceramic lo looking tag like ornament. They also had it in just a plain circle. And then they also had a heart. So I'm going to do something like resin related with these, but I thought these were really cool. Um, like blank slates to like do some kind of projects on or something like that craft wise. So stay tuned and I may share it with you guys. Okay. I picked up my batteries getting low. Let me hurry up. I picked up this scrunchie. It's like a ponytail holder and it's got like the things that hang down. This would be super cute. Love it. Dog treats for the dogs. They really like these. These are the poppers, the sprinkled hearts. They don't upset their stomachs and they love them. Cannot wait to try this. This is the Ardez Avocado Hot Sauce. It's a, a five ounce bottle. It's avocado hot sauce. Are you, I love avocado and I love hot sauce. So cannot wait to try it. If you want to review, you know what to do. Comment down below. Hey, I have an idea for something I want to make and I saw these little magnetic buttons. You get 14 of them and I thought this is exactly what I need. I didn't want to spend a tons, tons of money on a lot of them in case that I did an idea did not work out. So I had never seen these before. So I grabbed them. Greg needed a new loofah, so I got it for him. And last but not least, I grabbed these super cute fashion nails. They're called Seven Nail. I guess they're not sassy and chic anymore, um, but they are black with like this gold foiling splatter art or design on them. I love them, cannot wait to wear them. You get 12 of them. I use the super glue to put them on. There we go. That is my haul. I know it was a lot. Thank you for sticking around. If you um, are still here, don't forget, keep paying attention to all of my videos. I um, will be announcing a giveaway soon. It will not be labeled giveaway on the video. It will just be in a video. It will be towards the end of the month. So um, if you're still here, I'm gonna try these, okay? Let's try them. What flavor are we gonna try? The first one I grabbed which is blue. Okay, so they look like this. And they look just like sweet tart ropes. Okay, at first they were very sweet. And then I got hit with some sourness. They're not that sour. They're a little sour though. These are good. If you like the sweet tart ribs, you'll like these. Make sure they don't color my tongue. All right, well, that's my video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much if you waited this long and you stayed till the end. Remember, if you haven't subscribed, please do. If um, And for those of you that are already subscribed and you always view and comment, thank you guys so much. You guys do mean the world to me. I hope that I express that to you guys enough. Um, I love doing YouTube. I love all the friends that I've made and thank you. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.